Hi there, this is Fixed It. I've got a iPad Mini that I got off eBay, and for about a month it had a problem where it switched from 3G or 4G to Wi-Fi network randomly on and off, which was really irritating. But what's become even more irritating is that suddenly I switch it on and Wi-Fi is greyed out. However many times I hit Wi-Fi, it makes absolutely no difference. It's completely greyed out, so I can no longer use Wi-Fi. The other thing I noticed, if I turn Bluetooth on, Bluetooth isn't working, but I've got a dial that's just going round and round and round and round, and it never actually connects to anything. If I come out of here and I slide up from the bottom, there's obviously a Bluetooth option here, and if I click there, it tells me that Bluetooth is on, but I have absolutely no Bluetooth connection. Now, I've been online to try and ascertain what can be done about this, and there is not a lot. There's some incredible suggestions from people about cooking your iPhone with a hairdryer until it displays the dangerous high temperature warning sign, and supposedly that fixes it. But I think I'm going to uh, leave cooking my iPad until the last possible minute. And what I'm going to try and do is to find some other solutions. In the next video, I'm going to show you how I connect it to an Ethernet network so I can continue using the iPad on a network. The good news is that 3G, or 4G if I switch on 4G, is now on permanently. So it's not intermittent and it isn't a problem. It's now there all the time. So I can use it on a Ethernet network when I'm at home and I can just use the 3G or 4G. And if I let me just check that setting there. Uh, mobile data and roaming options. Yeah, it says enable 4G. So 4G is on, but I'm in such a remote location as far as radio towers are concerned, the, the best I'm getting is 3G. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.